We often get asked and see organizations looking for automated application pen testing. Well, it's great to do, but why should you not do it without having a full application pen test? The reason from my perspective is really that from an application pen testing perspective, you've got hands-on people trying to circumvent the security controls and also looking at logic flaws within your application. Every application is slightly custom. It's very difficult to unpick how these applications work for an automated tool. Automated tools need a lot of setup to get really good results. And that's why having a pen test done first, just to validate that you really understand the, the risks in your application and found those critical vulnerabilities initially is so crucial. Because then of course, it's great to continue to do more regular testing. Sometimes you can't afford to do that with, an with, a, with a full penetration test. So that's where the automated application pen testing comes into play. You can then use your automated pen testing to then follow on with those uh, regular scans to get, the, get, get a really good understanding if something new has been introduced um, to cover the gap between your next full application pen test. So for me, it's not that you shouldn't be doing application pen testing or you should, uh, should rely only on application pen tests performed by a human. You need to do both. You need to have both of those systems in place. I wouldn't rely on just the application pen automated application pen tester. Uh, pen test because ultimately you are going to miss some critical things that only a human can find. But equally, you can't do an application pen test every month. It's just not possible. So a good balance between the two things is going to give you the best results.